Hey everyone, Adrian here from RME. We are at the Elysia House Show to demonstrate the new AVB series, which consists of the M1610, the M32 Pro ADDA, the AVB tool, and the AVB Digiface. And here in the studio, we prepared some stuff together with one of the main developers of the AVB series, Mark. And he will tell you more about the M1610 Pro and the 12 mic. Hi, I'm Mark and uh, I'm a developer at RME, thus normally sitting at my desk in my office, uh, bringing out new firmware for you guys, um, doing concepts on new devices and stuff. And today is one of those rare occasions where I'm on the road um, and together with Adrian doing some uh, real world usage scenarios here at Elysia today. Uh, what we prepared over here is a bunch of AVB capable devices. We have the M1610, we have the 12 mic, also an AVB tool. Um, and we bundled that up with uh, um, Fireface UFX um, and also some nice microphone preamps from Elysia. All right, so let's start with the centerpiece of our setup. It's an M1610 Pro. Uh, you may be aware of this device, it has 16 analog inputs, 8 analog outputs plus 2 headphone channels. Uh, quality wise it's in the same range as the M32 Pro series. Basically it's just the same technology uh, but with both inputs and outputs in one device um, and with, without this extensive front panel unit um, which, which makes this one a bit more affordable than the M32. Here we're using it as a converter from the AVB domain into MADI. So we're receiving three AVB streams with eight channels each and converting it to MADI optical. This signal is then fed into the UFX Plus where we're using the Total Mix mixing engine in order to prepare the main PA mix and also the monitoring. Now we're on main stage. Here we have a 12 mic as a stage box next to the drum kit. The nice thing with the 12 mic is that it has direct access capability for each channel. So in order to do a line check, if you're uh, setting up this stuff alone, um, you select the channel that you want to level. Let's say the snare in this example. And then you see right where is the signal is in order or if it's too loud um, or too low. And you can regulate it very easily here with this knob. Here we are at the other end of the stage. It's quite far away from the drum kit and the 12 mic, so in order to get all these signals into the AVB network, we're using an AVB tool. The AVB tool has four XLR combo jack inputs that are switchable to TRS and also to high z The Phantom S and the MOOC are going into um, the first three, which are switched to TRS. And then here we have a bus DI input that is switched to high z the nice thing about this solution is, if for example the keyboarder doesn't like his monitoring setup with a wedge, he can plug in his in-ear monitoring or his headphones into the AVB tool uh, and is then able to regulate the volume of it and also ask for a separate mix. And of course during line checks it's very convenient that you have the gain control at hand. So this is the last stop of our small tour for today. Uh, we are here at Elysia's Class A studio. It's another part of the building, so uh, quite some meters away from the main stage. And we bridged this distance by using the infrastructure that, uh, is already, um, that we already found in the building. It's normal cut five cables uh, from the main studio into the server room and from the uh, server room here. Uh, over there we have an AVB switch next to a Digiface AVB and an M6010. Normally in this room uh, there is one ADI2 Pro and there are two chains of analog gear and you can uh, switch between them and, and do some mastering works. Um, but today we reconfigured the setup a little bit. We put the M1610 here uh, and are using the 16 in and 8 outputs to get into these two chains of, of mastering gear and out of it as well. So on Total Mix we now have all channels from the studio as well as um, inserts so to say or effects sent and ret return um, of these devices. So we have the entire capability of uh, yeah um, the main stage plus this mastering studio at hand in one Total Mix instance. All right so thank you Mark for your presentation. Sure. 
And as always, if you would like to know more about RME products, Total Mix Effects, or our new AVB series, write them down in the comment section below. And I see you on the next video, hopefully. And we'll give the stage now to the musicians and we'll hide behind Total Mix Effects. Yeah, let's do that.